Okay, so my name is Michael Harris, and I'm making a video about the response to Abercrombie and Fitch uh, thing, where it's called Fitch the Homeless. And for people that don't know what it is, it's this guy on YouTube that the video is called Abercrombie and Fitch gets a brand readjustment, hashtag Fitch the Homeless. And I'm just looking at all these comments, I'm replying and all this stuff, and I'm seeing that there's a lot of backlash for what this guy's doing. What he's trying to do is he's trying to make a statement that he has a problem against Abercrombie Fitch would rather burn clothing than give it to homeless. And people are getting mad because they're saying that he's using the homeless, that he's using them for his own personal gain, and that he shouldn't do that. He was, and a lot of people are saying that he didn't ask for permission for them, and he's not talking to them. But they're only using the evidence that they have from the video. They don't know if he asked them or not, and uh, he didn't. You don't know if he's talking to them. And why is he supposed to talk to them every time he gives clothing? If he gives clothing to 20 people, if you give clothing to 20 people in a few hours, are you gonna have a full, uh, full-on conversation with them? I mean, I don't think he should talk to them. And if he didn't ask them for permission, even though legally they're in public, he can. He should have asked them, because that's just common decency. But, um, people are, like, getting so pissed off that he's doing that because he's going out and giving people clothing to homeless people and he's saying they're using them. But his statement is saying that he's going against the statement that Albert and Crommie and Fitch would burn their clothing and give it to homeless people. And who else, and he's going out and giving the clothes to homeless people. So who else is he supposed to give the clothing to to make his statement? I mean, is he supposed to give it to middle class people who are in high school, who kids are in high school and want to dress and look nicer? I mean, I mean, yes, technically he did use these people to, <coughs> excuse me, to make his statement, but his statement was going against that it's wrong not to give clothes to someone just because they are less fortunate or homeless. Because that, that's the whole statement. I mean, he, who else is he supposed to give it to besides homeless people? I mean, I know, and I was reading this article that was published by Relevant Magazine, and the author is, what's her, what's her name? I don't see her name, but it's called Why Dash Fish the Homeless Backfired. And it was saying how uh, she's a social worker, and that she went, and people were uh, emailing her, and were going and telling her to go ask people, and she's against this, of course, and she's saying that people, let's see, she's saying that people, that he's, he's degrading these people, which, again, I can see how people see that, but I just don't think he's doing that. And some of the ho some of the things that the homeless people said, wow, the CEO guy is a bad guy, dude. Another thing is, why the hell would he pass out clothes to us that he wear, that he said, date rape is wear. And uh, there was another thing that he said, Let's see. Why isn't he talking to the people when he gives them the clothes? I hate it when people who think they're do-gooders act like that. And, and I see all these people who are like, why aren't you talking to them? Why aren't you doing this? But how many of you guys that give a dollar or actually do stuff for homeless do more than just give a dollar to them? Or donate clothes to Goodwill or, or the Salvation Army? How many of you actually sit down get to know these people and talk to them. I'm not saying none of you do, I'm just saying how many of you actually do are saying that this guy is not doing enough. Why are people getting so mad that he's saying he should be able to, he should be doing more when he's actually doing something unlike most of America who's actually not doing stuff for homeless people. And we were like he was saying and I read one comment that was saying that Pete he was like throwing them and was acting like they're like gross or something, but I, if you watch the video, he actually hands them to him, he talks to him. He may not talk to him as much as, as long as we like, but again, with the people who give a dollar, how much do you actually say, how much do you actually stop, how many of you actually stop and stand there and ask them how their day is while you're giving them that dollar? I mean, it's just something to think about and just something to, now this is not all my point, but I think I'm running on a little bit more, but tell me what you think. I mean, I have, I'm trying to keep an open mind about this. I'm not trying to stay closed-minded like a lot of people on here are. And again, I can see how it backfires for how people would see he's degrading them. I just don't think he's actually doing that.
But I mean, that's just my opinion. That's just my perception of the situation. And everyone has their own perce perce ah, perception of the situation. But I will, if I get enough replies, enough views from this, I will reply with another video. Or I will reply to your comment. Just please be respectful to what I'm saying. Don't be a dick. <laughs> and I won't be a dick to you. I will respect what you say. And I will get, argue with you probably if you go against me. But I will think about what you say. And I will be respectful in my argument against you. So reply, comment, do what you want. Thank you. And have a good day.